guys welcome back to my channel so today's reading is going to be about uh your like next intimate experience with um your like forever person so i want to like channel your like forever person and like see like how he's going to be like in bed with this person and we're just going to like start with like the general like energy of this person and personality and things like that so and then we can go uh, in like the more like spicy stuff you know so let's get into it so this person is represented by the hermit so this person might be someone that is very um that likes to be alone that likes to um maybe this person is also like very spiritual or at least likes to um like do some like introspection work like shadow work like this person is good at like um being honest with himself or herself you know um yeah maybe this person values like their alone time they need that also uh so this person has the seven of pentacles um so i feel like this person likes to like values the like work hard work but also um is very um likes to play it safe in in life in general uh is that someone that is going to like going to like spend all his money or her money on, on something stupid you know uh so this person is very like thinks a lot before doing anything i feel like and and likes to take his or her time with things and yeah just like play it safe also yeah so this person has also the tower and the and the eight of swords um so especially with the two things i feel like this is someone that is very passionate also and someone that um, maybe falls in love like a bit too quickly and like maybe this person like gets hurt sometimes by like doing that like, acting like that so and this card also like makes me think about like you know i don't know uh like i don't know how to say things like on youtube because i don't want to like get flagged or i don't know <laughs> um but um yeah this is like, to me like a very passionate person that's someone that is that also can maybe get angry a little bit like uh without like notice you know <laughs> like it just like being a very like imp not impulsive but someone that gets angry like like all of a sudden you know <laughs> i don't you, you don't really ex expect that um and maybe this person yeah i feel like this is like in love you know this is more like his career it's like finances this person likes to just like save money you know instead of like spend, spending it but in love i feel like they are someone that have trouble with their emotions i feel like and that falls in love too quickly yeah that's just like what it means uh so let's see like with his like friend and family like what is going on um uh, this person yeah i feel like this person has definitely like trouble communicating because otherwise uh this wouldn't happen i feel like this is um telling me that like this person's gets like can get pretty angry <clears throat> maybe this person has some like anger issues <laughs> and because they, they don't know how to uh communicate things um just they don't just don't like communicating i feel like they are not like good at that um they could have like they could avoid uh arguments a lot but they just don't know how to like uh say things calmly they just like go crazy <laughs> um they don't really like wait to um to hear like what you have to say like they just want to like uh flip out and scream and just like yeah get angry um so yeah maybe this person has to like that to work on but um like also if you're if you're talking like a bit more intimately you know like in bed like in the in this kind of like situation you know <laughs> um it could also mean that like this person um is like very just likes that kind of activity you know <laughs> and and maybe do likes to do it a bit like quickly you know like just very passionately like it just happens 
like out of nowhere you know i feel like you sometimes are going to be like like right here right now like are you sure uh, and i feel like this person likes to maybe do it like not only in the bedroom you know like so so yeah i feel like it's going to happen like a lot and like maybe but maybe not like for a long time but like a lot and like quickies i feel like you know so okay let's like clarify the cards but i feel like this person this person is definitely working on working on their like issues anger issues and also maybe this person like has gone through like traumatic stuff and it's also like hard for them to like heal from that and there's like regrets and mistakes so yeah i feel like this is like what they are like trying to heal from trying to like understand like why uh, they did certain things in the past so this person is definitely like has some has some um issues to like work through so and you also like, grave no second chances so this is in the like work um place so so maybe this person like has been let down like just like maybe once at least once you know in their like work life and like work like career in their career so and like they're someone like didn't give this person a second chance and like now they're like playing playing it safe because if they're if they if they think that like if they are like let down again then then yeah so they are like saving money like on, right now so they're not like yeah government like i said like spending every everything that they earn you know uh so with the tower you have mask nurturing true self and i'm sorry apology so i feel like they might be like hiding behind like um phys the physical stuff uh because they like afraid of like getting close to like someone maybe they're like ha they have like commitment issues and they need to apologize to like someone maybe maybe that will help them uh like um, not like because maybe they they like to jump into like relationships or like yeah relationships a bit too quickly uh, and like I feel like that's a problem with this person, and and I feel like they've they uh, they've hurt a lot of people by doing this because they weren't like actually serious, and I feel like this uh, that also has like hurt them, like they've been like hurting themselves also, but also um their like previous partners too. So so they need to like apologize to like those people, and they had courage, strength. And anxiety worry with the five of of ones. Um I feel like this person is like is actually like very not like confident and anxious person, but they hide that, like they hide it pretty well, I feel like. Uh people that like don't really like know fully like this person would, would be surprised if they realize that this person is actually like a pretty like um anxious and like not really confident person because they don't know how to like they should like really work on like communicating because maybe they need to like uh, talk to someone you know and they will uh, ask them like a lot of courage to do that but i feel like they really need to uh to talk at least to someone like wherever it may be um just going to do this one and then can go into the more like spicy stuff um uh, so you have betrayal, manipulation, and lies. So I feel like this person def definitely like needed to uh, lie to certain people. Uh, maybe they also like lied to themselves. So that's why that's why it was easy to just lie to other people because they also thought that it was the truth. But I feel like deep down inside of them, they knew like they were lying to themselves and to others also. But um, and they just like wanted certain people or like partners to certain like future partners to uh to like them and so they were just like manipulating them even though they they knew like inside of them that like they weren't really interested you know they wanted this person for like a certain reason for like they had a certain interest in like being with um those people you know this ex-partner so this person has also the key of destiny with like good like chance good fortune destiny um so I definitely think that like this person believes in twin flames, like uh, soulmates. I definitely feel like this person like still believes in love, you know. But um, and that like they are like focusing on on themselves, and they they will like meet 
the, the right person uh, by like focusing on themselves because like they know that like they're going to meet their right person like for them um if they are focusing on themselves and that's that's why they think that's why they that's what they are doing right now uh and that's like a good thing uh and you have doubts about hesitation uh and like fears and yeah just doubts uh so yeah they are still um doubting themselves and they're not like very confident in themselves i feel like they are, there's like some insecurities i don't like know which one like why they are like insecure about i don't know but they're definitely like still some like um doubts about if they are like truly healed from the past you know like they don't really know like if they're ready to like go into another like relationship and have the uh, unsaid things with like being quiet um and like hidden things so uh, yeah they definitely like have some things to work on like with the communication because they just don't want to like say th certain things that they will like definitely benefit from like actually saying uh, actually saying out loud you know and there's also like uh unfaithfulness with like temptation and like cheating so so this i feel like this person definitely like either like has experienced like someone cheating on them or they have been like the one doing that so um i feel like um that's why they don't really like get like like to get close to uh, other people because they are afraid that they're going to um to hurt them you know so they just like once it gets a little bit like serious then they just like leave like once they know that, that they are going to be with someone um and they know that like there's a risk that the, the other person might like break their trust they don't want to like take that chance so <laughs> they just want to like leave you know so or they might have been like the one like doing that but i feel like it is also like the no second chances so i feel like yeah that's definitely happened to to them um and they might also have been doing that after it happened to them because they were like angry they wanted like just to get vengeance <laughs> like i don't know um let's see like the more spicy stuff now so how are they like in bed what do they like in bed like what with will they like about you also uh there's uh, so this is protection so i feel like this person will not like be harsh with you like go too hard you know they will like be very gentle i guess and have the beginning which is fine so so that's definitely going to be like a love at first sight thing and it's going to like in the beginning of the relationship i feel like you are going to be very like do cute things and very being very passionate like this person is not going to like treat you like a corn star you know <laughs> at the beginning at least like they, this person is going to like treat you like a fragile thing you know uh and you have like stable being stable you should be fine also um so i feel like this person likes that like you are like physically very like maybe symmetrical um and that you also like you don't have like mood swings also that this person is going to find that find that very attractive and very sexy that you are just like someone that is very calm and like collected cool calm and collected just very um zen you know because they, this person like will see it maybe as a challenge to like try to make you look like very, maybe like a bit not disheveled like unraveled i don't know what's the word in english but like like they want you to make you like if you have someone that is very like always like well put together like this person will try to like mess up your hair or your clothes and like will want to like just undo everything you know and you have solitude i don't know like it's very dark this card so I don't know. um and so this is like a negative card but this is like i feel like this person is going to like really miss you when you're but <laughs> this person is going to really miss you when you're gone and they're going to like really be sad about it and like think of you like when you're gone when you're like not <clears throat> when you're not with them like not necessarily like separated you know but um just like when you're not there they're going to like think about you and like and like think about like what they want to do with you and maybe they're going to like text you like like just like come here you know <laughs> and i feel like like when you are like apart from each other like that's when 
the bonds between you two like deepen so like get stronger and like because this person will like miss you and you will also miss them but like you will when you get back together like you're going to like have like very intense passionate you know relationships <laughs> and on the back of the deck you also have twin flame so yeah this is definitely your, your, your twin flame so yeah you, ha you also have like i don't know how to translate that word exactly but this is like not having sex so okay i shouldn't say that not having sex <laughs> this also makes me feel like there's not going to be like and faithfulness going on not no cheating going on because if you're just not there if this person feels lonely they're just going to like think about you and they're going to like just um work on like just you know um even if it's a very like passionate person that likes to do it a lot uh they're going to like work on actually not like wanting that all like too much like not being like too addicted to because there's like people are already, like really addicted to that and also so this person will definitely like work on that when you're not there okay one last one again uh, and you have illusion i feel like even like if you have like insecurities like this person is not going to like see them as like flaws that you have like they're going to love all your flaws like don't be like worry about like if you have like stretch marks i don't know like most guys like like that i don't know i don't understand why either but uh but uh, yeah they're like that so yeah i don't know uh so if you have flaws i don't worry about them like this person is going to love all your like physical flaws you know so don't worry about that and you have betrayal again you have a lot of um this kind of energy but okay i feel like this person may like maybe also a bit jealous so this person is definitely going to like while having you know doing the deed with this person is definitely going to like show like a bit of like a dominant uh, side of him or her like there's like a dominant like domin dominant car domination i don't know um in the deck but um i feel like this person is definitely going to like maybe hold your neck or like uh while you're talking maybe you're going to like talk about someone and it's going to like hold your neck i don't know if you have if you like that um if you like that kind of thing <laughs> is the person definitely going to like maybe like hold you like a bit you know like have like a good grip on you like if when you know in intimate moments you know um so yeah during adult time <laughs> uh so this person is definitely going to like uh want want to really like hold you very tight when like wherever you know on your body uh during that you know sexy time so um so to like really make you realize that like you're not like going anywhere you know <laughs> that come like there's also like the possi possessive card inside so that could have fell also uh but i don't want the video to be too too long so i'm not going to like uh, shuffle too much again so <laughs> um but yeah that's it for me for now tell me if you enjoyed this reading if like i don't know if you just yeah if you liked it <laughs> and um so if you stayed till the end of the reading put uh like the scale emoji put like a scale can i show that yeah uh scale emoji he has like a scale there uh so yeah put a scale emoji in the comments so i know that you stay till the end and and yeah uh, uh, I hope you have a great rest of your day and yeah, I will see you soon.